Hello, 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 great viewers of my time. You are welcome to Bless Biafra Network, a bar no winging network where you can get an authentic news and the great news that you are looking for. Do not think we are joking here. Come to Bless Biafra Network right now. You will see what is happening. This is what we are talking about. It's one of the best. I'm talking about the best. What are we going to show you right now? Something new. Check it out. The headline says. Sen Emma Mwaka condemns proposed attack on Eastern Security Network by Nigerian Army. Now, before we go ahead with the news in detail, I will not stay to say please press the bell icon so that you will be notified anytime we we'll have news or video for you. And also, the rest subscribe button is very important. Now, let's go on with the news in detail. The former Abia State People Democratic Party PDP chairman Sen Emma Mwaka has joined his voice with other political bewigs of Southeast extraction to condemn the proposed military attack on the newly formed Eastern Security Network by the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP leader Mazen Namde Kalo. Read what the former Abia State PDP chairman Sin Emawaka stated clearly in a brief chat with our correspondent here. According to him, I must state that I am not a fan of Nande Kalo Titus. All the same, I am always bewildered by the ferocity with which our security agencies attack his every move. Most times, youth of Igbo origin who are suspected to be loyal to him are either manned or even killed in the process without condemnation from the rest of our society. What is trending now is that the military has deployed gun trucks and aircraft to ferret out the basis of his newly formed Eastern Nigerian security outfit. So far, I am not aware that it has been proved that Nande Kalo is leading an armed group. Meanwhile, Mieti Ala, a supposedly cultural group that threatened mayhem and claimed responsibility for some killings across Nigeria is not similarly Treated. The same goes for other non state security outfits. I must say that it is time. I must say that it is this unequal treatment that feeds the conspiracy theory that the Igbo nation is marked for extermination. I urge the government of the day to rethink these obvious cases of discrimination. To treat equal unequally is a receipt for instability and lawlessness with dire consequences for peace and unity. I will plead with the military now that they are at it to use the forces they have deployed in Igbo land to discover the forest bases of the henmen who camp in our surrounding bushes only to emerge at will to kidnap, key and rob our people. Now, great viewers of my time, all I can say right now is that it's time that our people, our governors, our senators, and our local government chairmen should stop being afraid of this man that calls themselves the Flani Bukaram soldiers. It's hard time they say the things the way it is and stop beating around the bush. What we are saying here is that we do not want Fulani to stay in our bush at all. They should go back to where they come from. If the man in Asorogo claim that those Fulani are from Mali, from, from Libya, some from wherever, then why is he kicking against our new, new created security outfit? Why is it that they stop the Igbo governors from creating a security outfit from the beginning? That is because even the Igbo governors know what is going on. But they have been bribed and some of them are, 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 are just there like that. Being black men for, by Nigerian government. Because of their treachery and other things. And corruption. But that will not stop us 
from securing our land from the hand of these Janjaweez that call themselves the Flanese. They are criminals. They are the strangers, the visitors in our land. Upon that, now they want to color be every goddamn land we have you know, in the country. That will not happen. It will not happen as far as we Igbos are concerned. That will never happen to us. It can happen as we are not in Igbo land. Their soldiers came to our land, they marked roadblock everywhere, claiming that they are looking for Flani men and Bugaram. And ever since then, they have not catch even common one of Flani men upon the whole thing they are committing in the in the land. Common one person. Upon the whole rape. And they call these people good soldiers. God forbid they are all Bukaram soldiers. Shedding the Flanis that are committing sacrilege in our land. They are together. If you don't know how to know it now, after T. Y. Danjima told you so, he said they are together. They are shedding them. They are collaborating with them. This is why we will not tolerate any nonsense in our land. Any governor or anybody in Ibo land who is sabotaging that ESN, believe me, what you will see, it will be very difficult for you to, to handle. If you are there, busy, telling all these people that call themselves soldiers, we are the ESN. Ah, believe me, you will regret it soon. I had okay, if I want is busy trying to recruit 18 years old boys for Forest Guard. For how long we have been telling these people to give us security, regional security outfit? They refuse. But they want to recruit a foreign guard. Bastards of governors. They want to use our people to kill our people. But I'm warning all those boys. Because at your age 18, you are still a kid. I'm warning you not to listen to, to Ifan Yuguani. He's a criminal. Complete criminal. That's looking for a way to, to, to dismantle Iboris. To destroy Iboris. Forget about that. He's a governor. He's working with for his slave masters and they can use you against the people and you will be the one to regret it at last i've told you before that eastern security network is a volunteer group from biafra extraction if you mess your life up they will kill you they will chop you like a fish better stay away from them that's what i can tell you right now great viewers of my time i want you to please Drop your comment in the comment section. Share this as tablets as you do. So, cheers.